I visited Japan's largest slum, an area formerly known as Kamagasaki, which has been wiped off the map, yet still exists in downtown Osaka. The 30,000 residents here are mostly retired day laborers who, despite having built this city, struggle to find housing today. That's why you'll see a lot of low-budget hostels in the area for as little as just $5 a night. What really surprised me is there is almost no begging. In fact, residents actually gave me free food and they invited me to a picnic, which I definitely didn't expect as I was told this is Japan's most dangerous slum. But in reality today, it's mostly just elderly people who are in need of assistance. If you'd like to learn more about Japan's voiceless communities, please follow me here.